Hello, and thank you for joining us on TVC Midday News. We begin in New York, where President Bola Tinubu has met with the President of South Africa and the Union of Com Comoros Island on the sidelines of the ongoing 78th session of the United Nations General Assembly. Nigeria's president is seeking to use these meetings to seek more investments and promote mutual cooperation between Nigeria and the global community. TVC News State House correspondent Femi Akonde has details. A busy day for President Bola Tinubu on the sideline of the 78th session of the United Nations General Assembly. He has held bilateral talks with the President of South Africa, Cyril Ramaphosa. Nigeria and South Africa are the two biggest economic giants on the continent. The main topic of discussion between the two leaders is how to increase investment among African countries. The President's intention to stake Nigeria's interest in the international community is also backed by governors who are on his entourage. And it would be nice for us to see him join his other colleagues worldwide to share his vision, to put uh, a clear template of what he hopes to achieve for the country, even in a gathering you know, like this. So um, um, it will be you know, his own show. Uh, and coincidentally, I was also here last year um, as a final one for the former president. Um, so outside of that, it's also for Lagos to be able to position itself for all of the engagement and opportunities that uh, an international you know, assembly like this offers. The meeting and engaging is for other world leaders to support Mr. President in order to deliver on the needs of the Nigerian people. But specifically uh, for Gombe, I've been able to meet with uh, uh, UNICEF, UNFA, and other agencies of the uh, United Nations in order to make sure that uh, we give the support required so that we can uplift the lives and livelihoods of our people. Diplomatic relations between the two countries dates back to the period Nigeria achieved independence from Britain and it was formalized in 1994. The volume of trade between Nigeria and South Africa has hit $2.9 billion dollars with expectations of it rising further with the Africa Continental Free Trade Area Agreement. South Africa is currently among the top 10% of investors in Nigeria globally. And Nigeria is South Africa's 10th biggest export market in Africa. Another bilateral meeting was held between Nigeria and the Union of Comoro Island. The two countries have maintained friendly diplomatic relations established in 2010. These meetings are among the first of many bilateral engagements President Tinubu will hold in New York. But the overall success will be measured by what kind of investments are attracted to Nigeria and its impact on the economy. Femi Akonde, TVC News, New York.